Well, good Sunday to you. Hopefully you were able to get out and enjoy this beautiful day we had. We saw temperatures in the lower 70s and pretty blue skies across much of the state. Right now we're in the upper 50s here in Tuscaloosa. This is taking a look at the Tuscaloosa Skycam out from the Bryant-Denny Stadium. Really calm conditions out there. Maybe a few overcast clouds coming into the area, but again, we saw a beautiful day, and we're honestly not seeing that bad of a night out there either. We really won't drop much in temperatures either. We're going to be in the mid to upper 40s tonight. Some of us probably in the upper 30s for the far northeastern part of the state towards Gadsden. But again, still relatively warmer than what we were last night. And speaking of warm weather, we're going to be warm over the next five days. Look at these highs staying in the 70s. So we're going to get a taste of spring. And I remind you that spring is only 11 days away, the official day, even though we already had the first day of meteorological spring. But unfortunately, we're not going to get to keep on to the blue, the pretty blue skies that we did see today. Look at the chances for rain over the next five days. Tuesday looks to be the highest. Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, maybe a few showers working their way into the area. And mostly a scattered event. But again, we're going to have to hang on to those chances. So let me exactly show you, let me show you exactly what we're talking about rain-wise, timing this out. See Monday, the clouds start to filter into the area. Maybe a few showers coming in for Monday evening. But most of those will be Monday night. Watch as they continue through until Tuesday morning and throughout your day Tuesday. So it'll be a splash and dash event. Maybe a few heavy downpours in those showers that are coming through. Something to watch for, though, will be Wednesday. Maybe a few... Uh, Isolated thunderstorms embedded with these showers too, and same thing for two, or Thursday at least, and coming into Friday also. So again, our rainfall, rainfall forecast totals from central to northern Alabama. At least it won't be a big concern for flooding, but we're still going to watch for at least one or two inches for central and northern Alabama, and a little less than that in the southern part of the state. Now tonight again will remain a little warm out there compared to last night in the mid to upper 40s. We're going to start to become cloudy as we watch that system start to make its way in for tomorrow night into Tuesday. And speaking of tomorrow, we're going to be warm in the lower 70s with maybe an evening shower coming into the area. Now your 7-day forecast again looks to be mild. Look at the 70s going all the way across the 7-day with rain coming in Monday night into Tuesday. A few isolated thunderstorms coming in for Wednesday and Thursday. But again, we're going to start to see a little bit of taste of spring as it is only 11 days away.